Now, again, I'm a Bengals fan, so you guys might say I'm biased, but what I'm going to say is just stop with the comparisons, bro. Enough is enough. If you go and look at how our play calling was called before Burrow got hurt and after, you see the difference. We're using Chase Brown now. We're using Joe Mixon more. We're running the football. Go look at how many times per game Jake Brown is throwing the football as compared to when Joe Burrow was in that, in that quarterback. Like how much better the offensive line now looks. Didn't allow a single, I think they allowed two or three pressures. Didn't allow a single sack in the, in the game against Indianapolis Colts. They're playing a lot better, right? Carter Wilson is taking a step forward. All these things have matriculated into why the offense looks a lot better under head coach Zach Taylor in, in uh, offense according to Brian Callahan. So, to a degree, the statement that he has better coaching. I will say that uh, with, with Joe Burrow, but that's not everything, right? Brian Silly just not that guy. When you give up a 27-0 lead and, and you still have your job, there should be question marks, Right? Are we going to sit here and say the Bengals are a more talented team? I know they got Jamar Chase, Chase, uh, Jamar Chase T. Higgins, and, and Tyler Boyd and Joe Mixon, but let's remember, Justin Herbert also has Keenan Allen, Mike Williams, right? Austin Eckler, who's a top back in the league. Eckler is better than Mixon. So when we sit here and say these comparisons that, that, that Herbert is better than him if he had better coaching, or Herbert is better than him, or the offense looks better, it's all because of the coaching, bro. Go get him some good coaching. Right, he's put up the numbers, right? But you got to at some at some point you guys got to say, okay, Herbert's just not getting it done, right? Herbert was played for most of the season, went on IR the last four seasons. They still had a losing record, you know. We were above five hundred um, before Burrow got hurt, okay? Burrow makes us look better in a lot of ways. Do we look good right now? Sure. Does it have to do with some of the talent we have? Sure. But what talent that we have that the Chargers don't have? Khalil Mack. Joey Bosa, Doran James. Let's be honest here defensively. Our defense, we have a rookie safety starting in Jordan Battle. We have a rookie corner starting in DJ Turner. Our best corner went on IR for four weeks. So what are we talking about here? All right, like I said, our safeties are new. Uh, Dax Hill is a, two, a two-year player now. So what, what, what are we talking about here? The problem is y'all don't have y'all talent playing up to snuff. That's the issue. But we're not going to sit and act like Burrow is not a better quarterback than uh, Justin Herbert. He's done it in the big moments. He's winning Slay the Dragon against Patrick Mahomes. He's 5-1 and one in his career against Josh Allen and Patrick Mahomes combined. Let's not do this this morning. Come on, man. What are we talking about here? You know what I'm saying? He had a chance to go to the divisional round and play the Chiefs, and they blew a 27-0 lead to the Jacksonville Jaguars. Okay? Now, you want to blame it on coaching? Some of that, obviously, a lot of, uh, some of that is coaching, but it's also some of that is on the quarterback. Some of that is on how the offense plays in the second half. So we're not going to keep doing this. Obviously, I like Herbert. I think he's one of the top quarterbacks in the league, you know, but he's not better than Burrow. There's levels to this, you know what I'm saying? And I know Burrow got hurt, and the, the, the stigma on him, on him is going to be, oh, can he stay healthy? He's been hurt two of the last four years. We're going to see. For us, if we keep running the football like this and we have a more balanced attack, we'll just be fine. That is proven it right now. That's all we need to do. But it's there and say that, oh, it proves that Herbert's better than Burrow. Let's not do that. It's not our fault y'all got whooped on national television 63 to 21. It's not our fault y'all were down 42 0. That is y'all. That is y'all owner. Y'all could have been let Brandon Staley go and got some good coaching in there. That's Keller Moore not being able to devise a game plan to go against the Raiders. Okay? This is not elite teams y'all playing and getting whooped by. Y'all scored six points against the Patriots. Come on, man. Let, let's, 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 let's be real here. Let's be real. Like, that is y'all fault. Y'all should be waxing those teams with the talent y'all have. So let's not say, oh, it's a talent discrepancy, because it's not. You know, can you get it done when it matters most? Burrow's proven that. Burrow's been to a Super Bowl. You know, he's been to the AFC Championship game. Let's be honest, man. Let's, let's, let, let's be honest. Again, no, no, shade on, no shade on Justin Herbert. He's a top QB in the league, but he's not better than Burrow. There's levels to this. Only a few QBs are at the top. Burrow is in that conversation. Herbert is not.